have the example of the only dual axis solar array in the state. That means it tracks the sun throughout the day, but also throughout the seasons. And it's able to capture 30% more energy because of that than the fixed solar panels on the roofs of our buildings and at the Garden Commons, for instance. It not only makes electricity, but it also makes hot water for the building, which is really cool. The Duffy Center right here is also a really cool example of a lead gold building. And this one is a lead gold renovation, which is the greenest way to go. There's a lot of embedded resources in any building. And so if we could save the bare bones of the building and rebuild it uh, in a green way, then we're doing truly sustainable things. One neat thing about the Duffy Center is that it has air quality sensors in every room so that it knows when to turn on the heating and ventilation system for that room instead of most buildings which are just set to do a certain number of air changes per hour. So it's able to save a lot more energy that way and keep the air in the rooms fresher. So even students can tap into the power of the sun here at UofL using our solar power charging umbrella with USB ports for charging your cell phones or laptops or other charging devices. But we also have solar powered trash compactors here at UofL, uh, right here at the SAC. This area is a place where we actually need to compact the trash with these solar compactors because there's so much trash produced right here. And why right here instead of anywhere else on campus? Well, it's because of what's inside the SAC, a lot of fast food. And fast food comes with a big price for us and our planet. Of course, we know it's not good for us. It's not healthy food, right? It's certainly not locally sourced or organic or anything like that. But another big problem with fast food is it comes with a lot of packaging. They're selling you advertising and they won't sell it without the advertising. So that means you've got trash at the end of your meal that you have to get rid of, which is another great reason for you to eat at the Phil Grill instead. <laughs> Thank you.